All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Abzu. Abzu? I don't even know. Um, music is very loud in my ear. We're not playing a scary game or a mystery game or a weird wackadoodle game. This game is supposed to be similar to the game Journey, which I don't think is a PlayStation exclusive, but it might be. Which was a gorgeous game, and I loved playing Journey on my friend's PlayStation. Oh, the music already sounds like Journey. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Oh, this is so gorgeous. <gasps> Look at the dolphins! Oh my gosh! This is so awesome! <gasps> and there's sharks! How deep are we going? This is so cool. I think I should turn off the lights in my room, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, now it kind of looks like the night sky. What is this? <gasps> Are we okay? We look a little bit dead. Oh, it kind of even looks like the journey people. A teeny bit with the head. <clears throat> Ooh. Guess we're okay. We're just chilling. Press what to dive? Press to dive. I don't know what you're telling me to press. Oh, I see it now. Oh, this is so cool! Look at me go! Oh, that's awesome! So this is Abzu. I don't know how to actually like, because obviously if I do this, I'm just twisting and turning. Look at the fishies! Oh my gosh! This is so pretty! Oh, that helps a bit. If, I'm, if I just hit the dive, if I keep the dive clicked, that seems to help. So as I was saying, this is by, I believe, supposed to be by the creators of Journey. And the big premise behind Journey was, it was a, it was a journey. <gasps> what are you? Ah, oh, it's inverted. Okay, I got used to this. What are you? Fishy! What are you? Hold to ride? Aw, oh, fudge yes! This is so awesome! Where are we going, fishy? I'm holding the ride. Let's go, fishy! Fishu! Oh my god! <laughs> this is gorgeous! I just, I really want kind of a break from the... The weird... games, honestly. Oh, what's that? Wait. What's this? Showing is going to be a little bit weird. I will admit it's going to be a teeny, teeny, teeny bit weird. That's okay. What are these? X. Ooh. Hawksbill Sea Turtle. <gasps> oh, they're so pretty. The controls are a bit, but I th I'm okay with it. I don't mind it being inverted. <gasps> Look at the oh my gosh! <gasps> There's a turtle. I wanted to find the turtle is what I wanted to do, truthfully.
We can ride the turtle. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is awesome. Well, the point of journey, there was a story behind it. And I don't know if there's gonna be a big story behind this. Um, and the other cool thing with journey is you could, you could actually meet other people. If they were playing at the same time as you, you could meet them. Wait, what was that? Did the fish move with me? Can I talk to fish? That is awesome. Wait, I need to go down. What is this? Oh, it looks like something that might help me move faster. Or something that's scanning me. Why is it scanning me? Oh, it's happy. <laughs> What are, are you my friend? We need to name you. We're gonna name you. What should we name it? We should name it Flounder. This is Flounder. What's up, Flounder? Do I have to follow him? Where are we going, Flounder? Flounder, where are we going? Oh, this is so pretty. Are, am I following him or is he following me? I don't even know anymore. He's kind of following me, it looks like. I know I keep on getting after it, but the point of journey was just... I mean, it was, a, it was a journey, truthfully. And I think that's what this is gonna be about. Oh, I'm doing butterfly kick. Look at me go. Look at me go. Look at me go. Dare I get this one? There you go, buddy. What's up? What's up, Flounder? Oh, there's another one. Okay, well, let's go get it then, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's there's never really like a blatant story. Um, Journey did have kind of a baseline story that you kept on seeing as you were going through and kind of piecing together, but otherwise it was just it was explore. You know, you just explored at your own pace. And that's so now we got Flounder and we could name the other one Sebastian. So we got Flounder and Sebastian. I'm just gonna go with the Little Mermaid references. What is that thing that's up? What is this? What is this thing? What are you? Oh. What's with the sharks? What is this? Back button to meditate. Interesting. So I'm meditating on... Oh, the fish are all kind of converging. What is happening? This is so cool. Yeah, I got used to the inverted camera. I went to this one. I'm just, just we're just gonna explore. Oh, I got a better kick now. Leopard sharks. Oh, we get sharks. Oh my goodness, look at them. They're so pretty. I didn't invert my camera again. I gotta ride one. Where'd it go? 
Well, I wonder if we're just kind of repopul- Oh, there it is. Let's go get one. Oh no, come back. No, come back. Come back. Still a teeny bit hard to navigate, uh, but not too bad, truthfully. You just kind of... I just want to ride one real badly. I guess. This is just... Oh my gosh, the fish are all following me. <gasps> oh, so cool! <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, is it eating them? It's eating fish! <gasps> that is so awesome! That is so freaking cool! It was eating fish! Have you heard the crunchies? It was actually eating fish. That was really cool. Okay, let's see what else we can find. So we went... Oh, I gotta go up. Went around here. What else have I not explored? Oh yeah, we're just we're having a nice little peaceful peaceful little swim boot game, so if you don't like the ocean, well this is not the game for you. I have no problem with the ocean. I understand it's very mysterious and kind of scary in some sense, because you don't know what's in the ocean, but otherwise I have nothing wrong with the ocean in my opinion. Oh my god, they talk to me! Ah! Flounder and Sebastian talk to me. How cute. Uh, do you think we got all of them? I feel like we... Oh, I guess we missed one. What are those? Oh, they're trumpet fish. Did we... Did we do? Okay! Well, that's one that we, it seems like we might have missed. I don't know if we're just kind of repopulating. I wonder if things are getting trapped. It's up to us to, like, free them? I have no clue. And I'm definitely going to be getting lost in here. I did that one already. Whoa. What is this? Yeah, I see it. Hi, buddy. We've got Flounder, Sebastian, and... Should we name that one Ariel? Maybe. Name Ariel. What is this, though? Oh, okay. I can, I guess, use them. Alright, my camera was stuck because I was near them, or whatever that thing was. I just want to explore really, really fast once more and see what happens. Um, this is, oh, there's something right here. This is why you explore. This is my kind of game, because I can just kind of meander about and I don't have a purpose. I mean, I like having a purpose to your game, but this is also just my kind of game. What is this? What, what is that a collectible? Guys, what just happened? That seems like a collectible in my eyes. Alrighty. Well, we got that. I don't know if there's anything else to get. Down here other than, you know, stuff. Oh, I just have the... Unless we should name, maybe we should name one of them Flotsam. This is just, oh my gosh, you got my horde of weird things. That I don't, I, I don't know what the story is and we might not know for a little bit. But this is just, this is kind of a chill game, you know? I just wanted to play a nice little relaxing chill game. Okay, let's progress. Cause that's where... I think 
we're I think we're okay. I think we got most of everything. Let's go to the weird whatever. Oh, that's where the shark was. Meditating shark. I guess speaking of sharks, Shark Week was up recently and that was real fun to watch. I always love seeing Shark Week. Um, Cause sharks do get a bad rap. I know that they're obviously they are predators and stuff, but sharks get a bad rap. Okay, let's, I guess we just go. Whoa. Bye coral. Okay. Guess here we go. Well, I guess we're going deeper into the ocean. Whoa! <gasps> He's hurt, or she. Where did he go? Where did he go? Anything above me? No, it doesn't look like it. The world is above me. We don't want the world. Ooh, we got more eels now. Can I ride one? I don't think I can ride them. Doesn't look like it. I, I really highly recommend anyone. I think Journey is now on all platforms, but definitely do Journey. Even do Abzu right now. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's Abzu. Okay, this is a wall. What is this? It's really the game is just kind of about exploring. And it, it has a similar thing to it. Where you use, like, the chirps to communicate. Which was also cool. Because if you're playing with someone else who's randomly, you know, appears in your game... You would chirp at each other. So you just do like a bit. And, ooh, here we go. And that's how you would communicate, because there's no other way to communicate with the world. It's I just these games. This is a, it's just one of these these types of games I really love, I guess. This is a, the best way to put it. It's just it's just incredibly immersive. But I understand obviously if you're someone um, just because I'm from the lovely state of Ohio. I know, and I watched some Markiplier, I know that, like, he is terrified of the ocean. <laughs> so I don't know if this would be a fun game for him, but let's go up, actually. I want to see what happens if we surface. Well, I can't really look. Eh, that was kind of sucky. It really is about the ocean. But yeah, he's very not okay with the ocean. Which again, everyone has their own fears. Trust me, I have my own fears too. Um, let's try to find that shark again, I guess. I think that's where I have to go, but I want to find the shark wherever he is, or she, it. I don't think there's much of anything else though to this area. That's where I came in. There's not, there's just a bunch of more eels. I don't, and I don't know what my communication blip does with my buddies. The shark was in here, wasn't it? I don't know where it went, but it also looked pretty beaten up, truthfully. No, I'm not gonna not invert my camera. I'm you're just gonna have to deal with me and inverted camera. Um, as I don't think, I don't think I wanna uninvert it. I think it looks this way. Well, I guess we just keep on moving on. But I feel that that shark's gonna be coming back. Sorry about that. I'm back. Oh my god, look at the one. It's like eyeballs are sleeping. Okay, I guess we just keep going.
going forward and adventuring. Um, okay, here we go, boys. And this, this soundtrack, if nothing else, please look up the soundtrack for Journey. Because it is equivalently as gorgeous as this one is so far. Where are we? What is this? Huh? I'm just kind of looking around. Um, obviously, we gotta go downwards. Um, I guess. And now we get into the weird part, it looks like. Why is everything dark and dead? It looks like a storm, almost. What is this? What is this? Whoa! What is this? Oh, we saw that in the beginning. What was that, though? Am I controlling myself? Nope, I'm not controlling myself. Where are we? We're in like... Oh, no, I am. Whoa. Whoa! What? Oh, there's the two... Those are the two, like, ammonites I found, or whatever. What is this? This is really messing with like my depth perception. Feels as though we gotta go this way, right? This is awesome. Maybe we'll have to go to all the other ones too. Oh my god, this reminds me of Life of Pi, which I despise that movie for various reasons. But uh, the the yeah the water scene—that's what this reminds me of. What is this? We're like in freaking Atlantis or something? Am I talking to like the heart of the ocean? I might be. Wow. I gave it my soul. It's like a weird. <gasps> oh my gosh. <gasps> I love manta rays. I am a person that will go to an aquarium and freak the F out over manta rays and sharks. I think they are some of the most gorgeous creatures to watch swim. Manta rays especially. Oh my lord. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're swordfish. Huh, or marlins? Are they called marlins or swordfish? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, we gotta find a manta ray. I have to ride a manta ray. I don't care what I'm doing, I have to ride a manta ray. Where are they? I gotta ride one. Oh my goodness. This is so cool. I know I'm just swimming through grass, but this is. <gasps> There's one. Let's go get it. Oh, we gotta ride a marlin. Hold up. We gotta ride a, a marlin. Come here. I can't ride it. Darn it. Let's find the manta rays. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Can I ride him, please? <gasps> yes! <laughs> oh my goodness. Riding a manta ray. I am freaking riding a manta ray. Oh my goodness. Okay, we gotta find the Marlin. Marlin's down there. I just saw one. Where'd he go? Come here. We gotta ride one of these guys. Come here.
gotta get to one. First and foremost, gotta get to one. Oh, those aren't marlin. Those are like sunfish family, it looks like. I don't know if I can ride it. I don't know if it's big enough. I might not be able to ride them yet. I don't think they're big enough. Just look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Look at them. Yeah, I don't think I can ride this. That's okay. Just, just look at this though. Look at this! Oh my goodness! This is so freaking awesome! I mean... Hey, besides my weird buddies who have, you know, Flotsam, Jetsam, Sebastian, Flounder. Okay, so we must have, we opened, so we brought life back to the ocean, it looks like? At least this one section, so I feel though that's gonna be our game plan for all of this, is we gotta bring life back. But I think this shark has, I really wanna ride one of these things. I don't think I can. I'm trying real hard. I don't think I can. I might be able to. I just might not be catching it. Just listen to the soundtrack, man. <laughs> Look at these bad boys. Let's go up this tree, actually. Let's see what's at the top of this. Look at this coral. It's supposed to be a coral reef of sorts. Just Bowser. Just awesome. Just epically awesome. I, I don't know if anyone else, but after, you know, Resident Evil and Call of Cthulhu, and then I'm my raging at Sherlock Holmes. Oxenfree is pretty chill. It's weird and freaky, but kind of chill. After all of that, I was just kind of like, dude, I need a, I need a nice, a nice a game. We can just sit and talk and just enjoy it. What it is, oh, jellies, there's jellies. And not be afraid. And nothing's gonna hurt me. Look at the jellies. Look at the jellies. Whoa, wait a sec. Wait a second. What is this? Wait, what is this? Well, there's... Okay, so you see the, the two shells I have are right here. So I found two of the shells. Oh, I must have missed one. So it, I think these are the levels? So I must have missed one shell in there, I think. Looks like all of them have three shells, possibly. There's the sharks and the whale with the volcanoes and... So there's those. There's fish in what looks like fast-moving water. I know I'm not giving you a great look at all this stuff, but... And then there's a temple. Huh. So, journey. Oh. Oh, wait, wait. Up. Up, babe. Up, camera. Here we go. This looks like. Oh, wait. I can hold it? Interesting. So, this looks like my people, and they have like a coral reef. See that reef up there? Huh. Interesting. Oh, here we're getting into the story, it looks like. And 
I don't know what the story is so far, but, and I don't know what we're trying to do here. Um, but with Journey, I think it was kind of, you figured out about your, your family kind of in a way. And just don't ever be deceived that this game is not going to harm me. There may be certain areas where I have to do stuff and not be super chill. This is just kind of the chill part. But if it's like Journey, Shiznit may hit the fan. <gasps> no! Flounder! No. Flounder. We lost Flounder. What? What? The fudge? What? What the heck? Oh, as you can see, all is not what it appears. Um, I think that shark's gonna cause us problems. Flounder? We lost our friend. We lost Flounder. Oh. You saw that, right? Big eyeball thing? This looks like it calls fish to us. Freaking Tony Stark's arc reactor. I guess we're going. Wait, did I lose him? Where did where did where did Sebastian and Flotsam go? Did I lose them? Do I not have them anymore? What's happening? I gotta save it looks like. Got a little triangle at the bottom. Okay, well, I'm going to end this episode here because we've now reached the second part. Uh, if you saw on the wall, there was the fast-moving water with the fish. So I'm going to end this episode here. Um, these are probably going to end up being shorter just because this game is much different than Call of Cthulhu and Leon's. It's not, I mean, it's story-based, but it's much different. Yeah, this is Abzu. I am incredibly excited to be playing this. Very, like, super duper excited I'm doing. All the flips and twists. I am incredibly excited because I loved the crap out of Journey. I hope you all are looking forward to a nice little reprieve from insanity. <laughs> because I sure as heck am, and I think this is the perfect game for that. So if you've enjoyed this first look into the world of Abzu, which I'm probably saying horrifically wrong because I don't know the accent over the U, what it stands for. I only know German with umlauts and we don't have that accent. But yeah, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up so I know that this is something you're interested in. Um, as always, please share with friends, family, whomever you think would enjoy the videos. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you get notified whenever I post new videos. I try to be pretty consistent, but life happens and I still deal with really slow internet upload speeds. No, not super easiest thing in the world, but I try. I will see you next time on this breathtaking game that I am super excited for. And I don't know what that shark has in store for us, but hopefully it's nothing bad. Alrighty. Bye now. <laughs>